Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, my name is Baka and today we're going to be doing a what's in my bag. I actually did one like a couple months ago, I want to say, and I did like my everyday bag. Like the one that I, you know, I go to Target with or like just go to the store, the grocery store, whatever. And I wanted to do what's in my work bag. So this is my work bag. Kind of see with the light shining on it. It's all I just wanted to do a quick video because my last video did really good. So I feel like people like stuff like this and especially like a work bag. Like you might want to see what's in this. Like I got some good stuff in here. This bag I got from TJ Maxx. It's an Aldo bag. So it has the nice like, it's just like chevron where it's like a angled like that and then a nice matte black chain same thing on the other end it just has the chevron but it's just a plain black purse i do want to get like a what is it like a like a keychain something cool to add to that so let's see what's in this thing so of course when i like look inside of it you have a zipper pocket and then you have two like slide in pockets so in the zipper pocket we have my car keys nothing too crazy about that um and then let's see, let's flip it over and go to the other side i have a little purse it's like a it's like a really cute vera bradley little bag um i have coins in here i really don't carry like cash it's more like coins or my cards so this is a little coin purse type of thing and then I have my glasses, easy access. I always need the, need this when I'm driving, um, like driving at night and everything. So I have that. I got this from I Buy Direct. They're just like big oversized glasses. I never really wear glasses just because, um, I don't know. I just like, I'm not used to wearing glasses. And I think because these ones are the ones that like don't adjust to your nose bridge, it's a little harder. So, and... I never really wear this anywhere except for like when I really need it. But then like if I don't clean it off beforehand, I get a little breakouts. So like right here, I have a little breakout. So if you see that little monster on my nose, my cheek, my nose, wherever in between, then that's what that is. I'm just gonna pull out everything else. So I have a notebook in here, it's just a cute little notebook with an attachable pen. Um, I just write notes in there, things, important information. I'll have that in here. Um, I have a water bottle. Um, I do want to buy a stainless steel or a glass water bottle, but I just had this. We just got a new pack, so I wanted to just bring something on the go. But I do need a shop for a reusable one because it's more, it's better for the earth. I got two clementines. I have food in here too. Of course, I'm going to have snacks. Like, if I'm going to have a big bag, I have to have snacks. So... I got these. These are the kind bars. This is the blueberry vanilla. Um, I just have those. I definitely need little snacks during the day. Um, and then I have these little, it's like crazy because they're all smushed, but these are Aussie Bites. If you like healthy snacks, this is probably one of my favorites. You can get it at Costco or Sam's. It has like quinoa, oats, chia seeds, I think that's, there's like more, but like it's like healthy for you. So it's like I might as well put a healthy snack in here. And I just have some loose things. I have like a bracelet. This is something that I got as a bridesmaid's gift. It's from Etsy. It's like a knot. And then I had this, this roll of mint because it, I used it earlier and I forgot to put it back in this little bag. So this is the last thing in this bag. So I'm just gonna put this on the side and we're gonna do a what's in my bag. And then a what's in my bag for what this is. So I got this bag from Mac. It was a free gift. So that's why I was able to put everything in it. It's super small, super sleek. It's like the size of my hand. So typically I have this roll of mints in there. But if you open this up, this is my little toiletry bag. Just in case like things happen. So of course, gotta have some tampons. Of course, always on deck, always got the three. I'm not too, too sure why three. I feel like three is a good number to have. Um, I have two lens wipes. Um, I think you get this at Costco or Sam's. It's just for my glasses, like if they're really dirty and like the, so the outside of this can clean um, your glasses, but sometimes it might not be enough. So this is like perfect. I have eye drops. This is just the clear eye sensitive eyes. My eyes get really dry, so. I'll use that if I need to, or if something is like in my eye, I feel like that really helps. 
I have a little lotion. This is the Hemp's Original. Um, I typically don't really moisturize them throughout the day. I moisturize them at night or like in the morning. I'm um, not, not necessarily during the day, but I have it just in case. I have a hand sanitizer. Love this stuff. This is the In The Stars. I like the perfume version, so I have a hand sanitizer version. Sometimes if you're gonna have like food, it's not really like the best time to have a um, scented one just because you can smell it as you're eating. Um, but I have this one just in case. I totally need to get like a regular unscented one just for when I do eat and I need that. Next we have lip products. So these are the two lips that I have. This is the Sephora brand um, liquid lipstick. I actually really love this because it is very comfortable on the lips without being super drying. Um, depending on what color you get, because I just got this one. This one's 96. It is a little darker, but it is a little drier. Um, so definitely want to moisturize beforehand or even afterwards. But the one I have on now is 76. And then this one is going to be a little darker. It's more on the darker brown side, but it's still kind of a, a, an essence of what that is. So I don't know if you guys can see that. This is the Rub Makeup Revolution Juicy Pout Lip Oil. So this is kind of like, it's just a lip oil. It's a lip gloss oil. No, it's a lip gloss. It's a lip gloss with cherry, raspberry, and jojoba oil. So this is perfect um, just for a light gloss or if I, you know, I just need to touch up or something. This is great. I love it. Um, next, I have some loose, like, like uh, flossers. I can put this, like, in a little bag or get those, like, individual wrapped ones or just make my own. I have a whole pack of these. I got them at Dollar Tree, so I might just pack this up and everything. Um, and then... It's easy, easy access. And it's only for my own use. This, I know this is like out in the open in this purse. So it's for my own use. Um, and then I have blotting sheets. This is the Ulta Beauty blotting sheets. It's nice because it comes with a, a mirror. So it has a mirror and it has this little blotting um, paper. I'm not too sure exactly what, like I think there's blotting paper on here and then not too sure. I haven't used this. I've used this, these little sheets in there, and they work great just to get my oils. Um, let me just do a little demo for you guys because I'm really oily right now. I just got back, so I am crazy looking. Um, but like you can see, like it really, I have a highlighter on my nose. That's why my nose is gonna be shiny. But my fore, oh my gosh, look how oily I am. My forehead is the oiliest thing ever. So yeah, look at this thing, ugh, gross. So it's a great oil absorber um, and I don't have to like put extra makeup on. I do wanna have like a compact, maybe like a powder or like a little brush just to have in my bag, um, but I get to do that. So I'll probably have to do that and add to this collection. Last few things, I have some hair ties. I've tied them together so it's not like just loose in there, but um, hair ties, I feel like my hair ties break. My hair is getting longer, so it's, uh, they break quite often. So I have these on deck. I have some deodorant. Um, I don't use this one normally, but I got this during a sale, so I'm trying to like get rid of it. This is natural deodorant. I'm not too sure about everything with um, natural deodorant. I'm still learning about it, but I also don't want to like use things with bad ingredients. like if i put like aluminum in it or something like right now the one i have is just like a regular deodorant it's not a natural one but it's i think it's an aluminum free and there's like other ingredients but it's not like a super natural one like this one so if you have any recommendations let me know um i did have a native one but native maybe native is like a step down from this and i just feel like it didn't really do anything and it's so expensive like natural deodorant is so expensive like i'm just not trying to get the bad stuff in there you know especially like in our kids this is a atomizer. I think that's what it's called for perfume. Um, I love this. I got this off of Shein for like two dollars, dollar fifty. But it's so cute. I literally have. I think I have my. I got a Target Mix Bar one. I think it's called Cloud Musk. I like the muskier, like, like. Someone said manlier. It's not like a manly one. It's just like a musky vanilla, 
like in the stars is like that and then if you have like black opium that's kind of like it too it has like a muskier undertone so or it's just like a it's like a spicy that's like what it, that's technically what it's called like a spicy undertone. i don't know whatever but this is what i use this is great um on the go i feel like body sprays they don't last on me as often that's why i want to go to get a perfume which black black opium would be my choice um but this is like a great on the go like i feel like if it's like it's gone i'll just spritz myself and stuff so this is great i love it i use this to travel and everything so it's been great Lastly, I have an air tag in here. Um, I bought it this air tag not for this particular reason, but I just bought it for I think I was going on vacation and I had some luggage that I wanted to check in. And I heard I always hear stories about people losing their check-in luggage. So I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna buy one and then we'll see. So then I, of course, when I'm not traveling, I'm gonna put this in my purse. So especially somewhere where no one really can find it, um, because just in case someone's in my purse, like this would be, if I put it like on the pocket, that would be the first place people would look for. I'm telling you all my secrets. I might move it. But in here, it's at the bottom of it, so then I really don't have to worry. Um, so yeah, so that's what's in my purse. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Um, I know it's kind of like a, like who, who cares? But there's some people that like, like this stuff. So I want to keep doing content for those people, especially something that like, is like, interesting like this like sometimes you look at people's bags and you're like i wonder what they carry like i could have a whole sandwich in here like actually have like a really small lunch box in here or something and i want to um start doing that actually just so i have this as my like lunch box i can get like something small i don't know we'll we'll see but i usually don't wear like big purses like this just because like a side bag like my brixley bag is so easy to carry and i don't have to worry anything i worry about anything plus i don't really like, go out like that so where i do go is like you know the grocery store or like tj maxx or stuff like that like i don't really need to dress up and this is like a dressy dressed up type of thing but you also don't have to so um I like this purse. I feel like TJ Maxx and Marshalls, they have really nice purses um, for a great deal. They always have ones on sale too, so I would definitely check them out. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.